What if my SC Mobile team wasn't chosen by me, but instead decided by you guys? Well, today, your suggestions are going to build my FC Mobile team. But if it doesn't lead us to end with at least a 96 overall squad, then some of the most expensive players we get will be discarded. So after asking you guys to submit your teams to my Twitter, we are now going to have a look at them and pick one player from each team. And after scrolling through just a few of these teams, I can see that this video is going to get pretty expensive. Expensive. And our first submission comes from Akambi, and he's got a 98 rated squad, and it's nothing that special if I'm honest. But the team that we are starting with today is only a 65 overall, so we've got a long way to go. Anyway, we should definitely take one of the highest rated players from this squad to start us off strong. And I would get that 100 overall Kalanoglu, but I feel like we can definitely get some better midfielders than him, so we're not taking that card. But boys, we do want to get ourselves that 99 rated Sol Campbell for our centre back. And we did pick him up for 24 million coins. That's a proper bargain. And he's the first player we're adding into this team. But guys, we're off to a great start in our defense. And let's see who we can get for our next submission, which is off Ali Hamza. And this is a really special team. He's got himself a 104 rated team worth 5 billion coins. That's very impressive. And I've packed that Nico Williams card before. He's very great to play with, but I have sold him since. We've got Hall of Legends, R9, Patrick Vieira, Zidane. Lots of great choices here. However, I'm definitely taking a fancy to their left back as he is one of the highest rated players in their team. So from you, Ali Hamza, I am going to get inspiration to put this Grimaldo in our left back position because I've already ranked him up to 100 overall. And I know it's not exactly the same card, but it is still team of the season. Not bad, not bad. Our team is still needing a lot of improvement though. So we're going to take it to our next submission, which comes from Richie Games. Oh, okay. His team has just about reached the 100 overall mark. And there's a Oh, ooh, there's not that many great players in here, though. I mean, he's got De Bruyne in the center mid position, but it's only a Team of the Year nominees card, and he's leveled him up to 25, and you can get stuffed if you think I'm going to waste, like, six of my Mascheranos doing that. But I can see a defender who's very tasty, and I actually have been wanting to get for a while. So I think we're going to bag ourselves that Team of the Season hero, Ricardo Cavallo, for our other centre-back spot. And so far, we are looking like an absolute tank in the defense. But there is something that I forgot to mention. If we do fail to hit that 96 overall by the time we filled up this squad, then we are going to have to spin this wheel, which will decide which expensive player we are going to have to discard. And to be honest, I don't want to discard any of them because we'll be wasting hundreds of dollars. But I am noticing the only people we've got so far are at the back. Let's see if with our next submission we can get someone who's actually playing up front or in the midfield. So will my next viewer be able to do that for us? And our next team is coming from Crazy Taco. And I'm going to be honest, I I'm not seeing any I like too much in this team. I would take that Cannavaro because that would be definitely the best choice from here, but we've already filled up those fullback spots. And if we're going in terms of literally trying to get ourselves the highest rated team possible, it's not necessarily the player that I would like to get the most, but just the person with the highest overall. And so for me, that's got to be this Henderson in the midfield. So yeah, Hall of Legends, Jordan Henderson, you can get in my midfield spot. I mean, you're pretty washed. You didn't even start for England in the Euros. And I'm going to be honest, if I could have chosen and someone better than you, I probably would have. Look at him. He's probably crying in my team right now because I just don't even want him. Oh yeah, guys, this video's just reminded me. Make sure that you hit that subscribe button and also let me know which is your favorite card in FC Mobile because you just might end up in my next video. Well, let's hope that I want a player from our next subscribers team. It's from John373. And oh my God, that's a beast teammate. Yo, John, you, you are killing it, man. And he says this is a free-to-play account. You're telling telling me you did all this without spending any money, man. Okay, I can tell you right now that you you probably don't have a life, do you? And that's all right, because neither do I. But look at this. We've got my nan in goal, the right guard, De Bruyne, Messi on the wing. We've got Mbappe on the other wing. You're teasing me. You're not in that. But I do want to think smart about this and not waste all our money straight away on some of the strikers. And that is why I want to complete our defense by getting this brilliant German right back, Philipp Lahm. And if we whack him in there, that is going to bring our team up to a gold rating. We're now 81 overall. That only leaves us 15 overall to go. And I'm sure there's going to be plenty 
plenty of teams available for us to choose some better strikers from. Because one of the people I want to introduce to those upfront positions has not appeared in any of these teams yet. Comment down below who you think I might be waiting for. But our next team comes from Jake and he's got quite a nice looking team again. And there is someone in this team who I have already got who I think would fit perfectly. It is of course this Icon Chronicles Steven Gerrard. And yeah, he's not quite a hundred overall that Jake has leveled him up to in his team. I just, I don't, I don't have the Mascaranos, mate. I don't have all these upgrades. So we don't have the capacity. And guys, I've got to say, as far as we've got so far, this is actually going fairly well compared to how we usually go in videos. I've usually got a stinker couple of base cards in my team by now. But no, we've got all the top of the range cards in our squad. Let's keep it going. But our next submission comes from Dave and he says, this is my team. It's not the best or the worst. Love you. Oh. But anyway, let's check out what he's got going on. It's got five at the back, you sweaty bastard. I'm only joking, Dave. I'm only joking, but bleeding heck. Talk about park the bus football. Who are you in reality? Flipping Gareth Southgate. And thankfully, none of those back five are actually of any impressiveness because we can't take either of them anyway. We've got a full defense as it is. I don't want the goalkeeper either. Jordan Henderson, we've already got Tim Cahill. Wow, what a throwback. The Australian menace from my club Everton back in like 2012. And then we've got Jonathan David... Nico Williams, not even his Euros card, is flipping base team of the season card. And Di Maria on the right wing. Wow. Okay, this is the actual first team, which I'm, I'm not happy about any of the players. Out of pure respect for my club, Everton, I have bought this prime heroes, Tim Cahill. And oh my goodness, I am an idiot. I just realized I don't have another center mid spot free. Oh, I've actually screwed myself there. Why am I such an idiot? Even when I made videos, when there's no challenge that I can fail, I still somehow managed to fumble it for myself. But now that leaves only four spots left in this team. That is the goalkeeper and all three of our forward players. And this is where it starts to get pretty pricey. But I still have got over a billion coins to spend so we can afford to spend our money, baby. <laughs> but only if our next subscriber is going to give me the chance to. Because it comes from Mr. Tactical. And let's have a look. Look at his squad. Oh no, it's nothing special again. It's between, I'm going to be honest, it's between Kane and Chesney. I don't want that right wing spot filled with Rodrigo. And I definitely don't want that left wing spot filled up because of the player that I am counting on being at some point later in the submissions. If he, if he doesn't turn up, I might actually cry. But we are going to go and... How the heck do you spell his name? But we're going to go ahead and pick up ourselves this Euro Chesney. And we'll whack him in the goalkeeper position. And I'm going to have to hope that I have not just gambled on the forward spots. Because what if the rest of these submissions now only have stinky attacking players? We will literally have screwed ourselves over and we're going to have to spin that wheel to discard one of these players. But anyway, boys, we are now 89 rated overall and that leaves us only seven more points to go to lead us to the safe zone. But for these final three players, we're turning to the direct comments on my video. And our first submission comes from a man called Alias. And oh, oh my goodness, there are a lot of guys with teams called Alias. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just pick from either of these first three at random. They're all fairly similar overall, so it's not as if there's much difference. And I'm going to go straight down the middle, actually. Please, please have someone up front that we like. Ooh, okay. All right, all right. Lads, I'll be honest. Not who I was hoping for. But at the same time, it's not the worst in the world because we do have Lewandowski. 33 million coins, obviously not the ideal scenario, but he is still pretty highly rated. So what is he going to bring our team up to? We're now at 91 overall. Oh, we are relying heavily on the next two teams to bring us up to a 96. Guys, I'm, I'm going to be honest. I, I don't think we're going to do this. But let's look at the team on average so far. The average rating is at least a 97, but it's just that Tim Cahill that brings it down. But which of these other teams should we choose for our next submission? Oh, this man has a 103 rated team. I'm going to go with you. Person 11. Let's hope that he's actually actually got an account. There it is. Oh, it's 101 overall. Someone is lying about their credentials. No, I'm kidding. I'm sure you've just sold off a couple of your players, but let's hope that it wasn't any of some good upfront ones. Oh no. Oh, 
Oh dear, it's it's not it's not great. It's not great at all. I mean, it's a nice team. Don't get me wrong, but you can understand that I I don't want any of those players. I think it might have to be Clint Dempsey. I would take Phil Foden for the left wing, but again, he's not who I was waiting for to come up for the left wing spot. I'm hoping maybe our last submission will be him, the mystery player that I want so badly. I mean, if you guys have watched like more than one of my videos, you probably already know who that is. But Clint Dempsey, the Yankee Doodle, we have picked up for 32 million coins. He is 98 overall, so I think he might do a bit of justice to our team here. Let's go ahead and whack him in. Oh, 95 overall. 90. Okay, all right. We might be safe. But for our last submission and the last player to go into this team, we are going to choose... Football Deity. He's got 102 rated team. That seems like a smart decision to us. Now, please, can you have the left winger that I have been looking for for this entire video, but no one seems to have, even though he's the best player in the world that ever lived. But if not him, please at least have some decent left winger. Oh, God. Watch him have like a bronze card or something now. Oh, he doesn't even have a left winger. But he does have this good Muller up front, which we are going to pick up ourselves for 55 million coins. And I don't think there's too much suspense about whether this is going to make us a 96 overall. But let's just whack him in anyway and see if we reach victory. It's a 98 overall. Oh my goodness. Wow, that's a high rated team. And it's worth half a billion coins. Not, not bad, guys. You did me well. But if you guys enjoyed this video, then make sure you check out this one because you're going to love it even more. It was so much fun to make. Make sure you watch it now. Ow.